to the channel. It's your girl, Shanuja Nicole, and I am back again with another DIY video. Okay, y'all see, I got some gifts with me in the bed. Oh, I got my girls with me. Where my girls at? From the front to back. Is you feeling that? Okay, yeah, so I seen all the love and support that we got in the last video with the tutu sauce, and I said, look, I gotta, I gotta keep it coming. I gotta keep it coming, okay? So I decided to redo my bedroom. We redecorating. So, y'all, we gonna, we gonna Finally. make a <laughs> not a ladle. <laughs> get beat, not a ladle. Okay, so I decided to redecorate and redo my headboard. Me and Babe did the first two headboards. We also did our bed frame. I'm gonna include the clip of that. <laughs> already and this is my first time doing this style headboard so i don't know how it's gonna go y'all don't 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 do me dirty okay but we got we got our supplies we got the polyphone two inches i don't know if that's gonna be enough you just hope that's gonna be enough we got our staple guns we got two one for me one for her you're gonna need something to measure with so i got this and oops and a ruler but I got this because this this long though. Um, we ain't doing no hair, but we got us some Gorilla Glue, the spray adhesive. This is to stick the foam in the batting to the um to the headboard. You're gonna need something to cut through the foam with. So I don't know which one we're gonna use, but I got three of them just sure. And then you're gonna need um, scissors to cut, you know, the batting and your fabric, of course. You're gonna need something to mark the lines on the uh, foam when you measure out with your ruler. And then of course you're gonna need your fabric and your wood for your headboard. Like I stated, I already did this headboard or did a headboard this is the third time. So we didn't need to go to the store and get another um, thing of wood. So we just gonna work with what we got. So I don't know the measurements. I just know we got a queen size bed um, that we working with. So this, our headboard is gonna fit our bed. New subscriber, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you like it here. And if you are a returning subscriber, hey, hey boo. boo! Okay. Headboard, just a piece of plywood that we got from Home Depot. Had them cut it to the size of the measurements that we needed. Um, this is to anchor it to the wall, so ignore that for right now. This is all the old batting and the faux leather that was on our headboard. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and flip this over, take the um, take everything off, and then we're just gonna reuse this board. All right, y'all, let's go.
So we are going to use our Gorilla Spray. Right on this board. And then we're going to put our foam on top. Hopefully this is big enough. We got enough. If not, we're going to have to uh, work it out. Okay. We got two different color phones because this is the old phone. This is the new phone. The new phone was not enough to um, completely cover the headboard. It's not much, just this little, uh, mm -hmm. just, little just that little piece. That's it. Nails didn't go all the way through. Some of them did, but it's okay. We're gonna just hopefully none of our lines that we have to cut um, go through here. So we're gonna have to measure it in a way that it does not like it, it, it comes to the side and then we just cover this up with fabric and we don't have to cut through so let's go ahead and um spray and get this down okay so guys we have to open the door so the smell don't get attracted ventilation ventilation purposes we had to open the door you ready okay i'm gonna spray and then you press down
Yeah, we we um, measured um, the length of the headboard, found the half, and this is where we're gonna start making our lines at uh, to make our channels. And then we're gonna go half from that, and then we're just gonna keep on. So that's what we're doing right now. We got making the lines, and this is our halfway mark. So y'all, we have messed up. Yeah. Well, Mr. Antoine messed up. <laughs> you was on your job. <laughs> so half of But this. we fixed it. Kind of. Just like Yep. <laughs>
But we did, um, we made it work. We made it work. And now what we're going to do is use the knife to cut the lines to make the channel. Mm -hmm. Four. Something, something, something. I'm doing a YouTube video right now. Boo. <laughs> <laughs> How you going to laugh because of the other thing? Uh, I was trying not to, but she killed me. <laughs>
we're doing is we we found the center. We're going to start from the center. You always start from the center and work your way out. So we found the center and we're just pressing the fabric in between the um, folds that we have. y'all okay we're in here <laughs> 20 hours later for real <laughs>
channels. So we pulling the fabric really, really tight. When you pull it tight, it makes the channels. So we're pulling it tight and then we staple it underneath and we're gonna do that all the way around. Then we're gonna cut off the excess fabric. So y'all just, just hang out with us, stay tuned. the video sorry it took so long but this is the outcome of the channel headboard okay so we went with you guys saw in the beginning of the video the navy blue like uh fresh velvet look i think it turned out pretty good i like it better than what i thought it was gonna look this is by far my favorite headboard that we have done do not mind the bed linens i'm gonna change those out and go with something different um, I'm thinking of doing like a luxury hotel like kind of feel to it. So, you know, I'll probably keep the gold pillows, but everything else will be probably all white. Um, I do also have to paint the uh, lamps, the bottom of both lamps. I have to paint both of those as well as redo this mirror. I did this mirror myself. If you guys want to see how I did that, comment down below and I will record myself redoing this mirror because I have to redo it, take those out, uh, fix some that have fallen out as well as paint that gold. So I'm gonna do that. I have to get some different uh, um, Drapery for the windows um, This is something that I had and I just repainted it. I painted it white added some stuff to it I don't know if this stuff is gonna stay if it's gonna go but you know guys get into the aesthetics of it Okay, I think it looked pretty good. Um, just just I'll just put together this is where we got the inspo from the uh, for the room. You know, I got this from I believe Ross, either Ross or Home Goods. This is where I got the picture from, um, and we decided to go with this color scheme of the room. Okay, and I also I want to put like a, a fur rug down, a white fur rug. I'm not sure. Um, this is the throw on the bed and the bench. It's the same color as. The headboard with the gold legs to go with the rest of the room so you guys this is the finished product okay i hope you guys like it do not forget to like comment and subscribe to the channel okay tell a friend tell a friend tell a friend we need more people to join the family okay we're on the road to 1k help us get there okay share this video and like i said if you want to see other videos you guys want some suggestions there or some comments whatever you know I'm, I'm open to all of it comment that down below as well and hit that red bell so you guys will not miss another upload from me if you have not already okay stay tuned for the next video bye guys love you